Okay. Recording? Yes, we are. All right, ladies and gentlemen, what is up? ADS Play 101 here, and welcome to the beginning of the Super Mario RPG remake. Some of you guys know I did play the original uh, Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. I played that a couple months ago. Um, either it was early October or it was like late September, but I, but I, I beat it. So I really enjoyed the game. It, it put Mario in a different light for me. And uh, this is a classic adventure with a new look. So, for what I'm to understand, they kept a lot of the original uh, little Easter eggs and little hidden things that I'm going to try to find. But uh, for the most part, man, I'm just looking to have fun and, um, and, and revisit a game that I enjoyed a lot. So, that being said, man, let's get this adventure started. Breezy. Uh, I'm put put this on normal. Make sure that the audio isn't too high. It should be just high enough. Yeah, that should be good. Yeah, you know, this fan is blowing right now. There's nothing I can do about that. For the most part, it starts off the same, so I'm assuming Smithy drops down from there. So we go fight Bowser at the castle. From what I remember in the original game, we fight Bowser at the castle, Smithy drops down, he takes over Bowser's castle, and that's when the adventure really starts. I don't know why, this actually looks... Looks really good. Special moves, items. I'm not gonna lie. In the last Super Mario, in the original Super Mario RPG, um, I played it on an emulator, and it was like a difficulty spike between, like, one of the later bosses. I think it was like Johnny, like the Hammerhead Shark or something like that, or, or the Great White Shark. But that's like later in the game. So I'm, I'm assuming. I'm wondering if it's gonna have that same difficulty spike that we had at that time. We'll see. I need to get familiar. Okay. So they still got the the timed attack that they didn't get rid of that. Still got the <laughs> same thing, oh, but but I do notice you got to tap a lot sooner. You know the original one was kind of slow, so. In a, in a way, I kind of wish they would have added health bars. Did he just... I'm going to assume that he shot out a spike from his back and not his backside. I look crazy. Oh, 
Tell him you attack the damn chain. That's why I'm attacking the chain. Who knows about a scary team? Whatever you do, don't let go. Come on, Mario. <laughs> Give her up. Give her. You're always in my way. This is it. I'm gonna take you out, Mario. Fuga. Mm -hmm. Let's get out of here. You know, after all these years, they still never gave Mario a voice in the game. Like, he got one, but he doesn't have any, like, dialogue. And I thought they would have changed that up at least. One thing I don't think that they did was explain where the hell Smithy came from in the original game. It was like he just appeared out of nowhere. Super Mario RPG. Gets thrown. Mario's pad. Mario live in a shack. There are lots of people who use something called a door to go in and out their houses. Anyway, I came by to pick up Princess Peach, so she's a bit late. switch I still got that that didn't change nothing stored in the box I don't think I ever put nothing in the original in the original game like I don't think I ever put anything in the original in the box in the original game excuse me This little, uh, looks different. But at least they kept the, the pipeline out uh, border for the stats. So, what's with the silence trip? You're not telling me something. Bowser again, isn't it? Oh no, we're gonna get Mario. You should bring her back like you always do. I know, forgot something important. If you get knocked out, you'll wake up at the last place you save. But guess what? On this adventure, you'll save automatically whenever you go in between areas. It's all the same. Okay, so they changed that. Did they get auto save? I mean, I would hope so. Which comes to worst, you won't lose much progress. Just like the good old days. So he references the original game. Use the, you know, however you like. Great for it. Taking a break from the adventure. It's very important. I can think of. How the hell do I? So I'm noticing that they don't have like a run button. Like in uh. Like they don't have a run button, what they got is a walk. So I'm assuming that that's as fast as he can go in the game. Who goes there? A trespasser? This castle belongs to us and the, to us, the Smithy game. We have big plans and this is the first step in them. If you weren't for nosy if it weren't for nosy characters like you, we'd practically own this world. <coughs> Let's see you deal with this. And this is when they 
break the bridge. to Mushroom Kingdom, I think. I think that's the next stop. Go back, did you forget something? I don't know what happened there. The Bowser's keep is out. Just wonderful. We must inform the, the, the Chancellor of the Mushroom Kingdom. Let's go at once. One thing that's cool that if you did play the original game, you can go back and use it as a reference as to where to go next if you, you know, played it like I did. Excuse me. Oh, that bump on your head reduced the HP level. One of the Mushroom Kingdom's famous items ought to prick you right up. Whenever you want to use that, just press X. Even the Mushroom can boost you whenever you feel tired. Now, why did I rush back? Oh, I had something to tell you. I gotta remember I came to warn you the Mushroom Kingdom is swarming with monsters. I just barely made it back in one piece. Mario, please do something. Perhaps I can help. You know about action commands? Yes. You better watch out. He knows about action commands. He's gonna punch your lights out. He's got more bark than bite, huh? Now why did I rush back? I had something to tell you. That's right, we need to tell the Chancellor about Peach. I'll see you over the Mushroom Kingdom, just in case take these with you. Alright, bet. We on our way now. 